you're going to need to um, add two new things to your GIMP. One is a script and one is a plugin. First of all, the script is called Layer Effects. It's pretty popular, so a lot of you might already have this installed. But if you don't, um, you're going to need to go to this page. I'll put the link in the description. And scroll down here. And right click on where it says Layer Effects.scm. That's a script foo script. And just right click and choose Save Link As. And then you're going to need to go to your scripts folder, which usually should be something like this. Um, might be, this is on Windows Vista, might be a little different if you're using a different operating system, but it should be something like your username, GIMP 2.6 scripts. And you can see I've already saved it there, so I'm not going to save it again. But all you need to do is just push save, and then you're done. Then for this plugin, this is called the GMIC plugin, or the gimmick, I'm not sure how you're supposed to say it. But uh, this is made by the same people who wrote the Grace Easteration plugin. So if you already have that plugin, you actually don't need this new one. We're just going to be using the function inside this plugin that's exactly the same as the Grace Easteration plugin. So if you already have Grace Easteration, you can just use that. But this is the newer version that has a lot of other stuff in it. Um, so I figured might as well go ahead and install the new version if you don't already have the old one. So just uh, click on whatever operating system you're using. And it'll take you to a page at SourceForge. And you should get a little pop-up window. So go ahead and save that. I'm not going to save it though since I already have done that. And then once you've saved it, you'll have a zip file and you'll want to extract the contents. And then you should have all this stuff. This is what you'll get with it, for the Windows version at least. So what you do is you just um, copy all this stuff. And then you want to go to your GIMP plugins folder, which is going to be in the same location as the GIMP scripts folder. So it'll be something like um, your username, GIMP 2.6 then plugins. And you can see I've already pasted all this stuff in here, but you'll just go ahead and paste it in there. And then you're done with that. And then you can restart GIMP and you should have both the script and the plugin installed. The script installs itself in this new menu called script foo, layer effects, and these are all the different effects that come with it. We'll be mostly using the bevel and a boss effect. And then the GMIC plugin you can get under filters and it's listed down here at the bottom.